Hello everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to it if you're new. And welcome to Adventure... God damn it. <laughs> Why am I keep messing this up? Amanda the Adventure. Uh, the re uh, I kind of checked this game out to see if it was similar to how the build was before. That's why we got the continue button. Uh, anyways, let's just jump right into the game. I gotta say, there's not much differences to the map, though. So, yeah. Let's just go right in. Yes, I would like to start a new game. Start from fresh. Ah, dear Riley. If you are reading this, it means you won't see me again unless it is in the next life. I wish I could have told, <laughs> told you everything. I don't know how much time I have. And there's still so much I have to do before I'm gone. This letter serves two purposes. To say goodbye and to bestow <laughs> to you my house in Kinsdale. This next part may be a mistake and gods forgive me if it is. When you settle in, there's something in the attic I need to pass to on to you. Look for a tape, but know that once you watch it, there's no turning back. Stay safe, my dear. With you always, Aunt Kate. And a little bit of controls up here. Okay. <laughs> this game used an autosave feature. Do not quit or turn off the power while this icon is displayed. It's a little apple. An apple a day keeps the demons away, hopefully. <laughs> Probably not going to happen, but... Yeah... As we can see, the map's not really that different from when we last played it on the channel. Though, I gotta say, there's a few notable differences, such as like this little toy robot, and this doll. Who, to me, looks a lot like Poppy Playtime. Like the little ha uh, red hair, p uh, pigtails, right? Honestly, really don't know, because I don't have my hair like that. Even the uh, tapes are the same. Hello. <laughs> certificate. This certificate is presented to Catherine. March 12th, 1993. Wait. Energy transfer. Woodsy Sickles. However you say that. <laughs> TR. Investigating. Potential for Dynakinesis. School records. Behavioral complaints. Make appointment or few cold cases. Disappearance. Building is still too risky. It's still there. Too risky to investigate. When did it change? Oh, we got some notes. I'll let you like stop, uh, pause the video if you choose to and read these if you want. I ain't gonna stop you, but if you like to. All right, got done that. Let's go. <laughs> Maybe. Odd oh, symbols. I'm not worried about the symbols. Unless you could not get loose. Because I don't know what they do. Oh, hi. Wait. I didn't expect you to be here. You know what? <laughs> you know what? Let's just jump right into the tape, shall we? So, this first tape is obviously the same as before. Her in the kitchen hi, making I'm a pie. And I'm Wooly. <laughs> and I'm <laughs> I can't an make apple pie. pie. My favorite is peach pie. What's your favorite kind of pie? I like apple. If you ever do like a... That sounds delicious. I, I'll say it after we're this. Going to make an apple pie. Cause you know we First, can't talk we over need here. To cut the apple. Hmm, do you know what we can use to cut the apple? The only logical thing is a knife. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> we can use a sharp knife. Uh, I don't think we're supposed to do that by ourselves. It's always good to be brave when you're by yourself. I like how but Wooly's the I'm only, tiring. like... <laughs> Wooly's literally the that only seem safe. logical okay, one in this. Wooly, let's cut the apple. That was hard. We have almost everything we need to make our pie. I'm just gonna we go through with everything sugar. as normal. Hmm, do you know where we keep the sugar? Is it in the pantry, the refrigerator, or the sink? At a pantry, that's reasonable. <laughs> Wait, let's make a pie. Okay. Mm, can you smell the, the apples apple and cinnamon? cinnamon? No, I cannot. You're okay, in the TV screen. It's time so. to bake a pie. First, preheat the oven to 
25. I don't think we should be using the oven by ourselves. We should always ask a parent to help. I'm not sure where they are right now. Oh, you creepy little sucker. First, so 425. 425 degrees. Then put the apples into the pie tin. All right. Now put it in the oven and bake it for 40 minutes. Why'd that sound like Nightmare Foxy when he like gets you in the uh, closet? I can't wait to eat it. I do a little. Ah. Let's have some pie. Bye bye. Why does she look like a mix between Mickey Mouse and Dora the Explorer? <laughs> I just never realized that before. Uh, but yeah. All right, let's do this. And like I was saying, actually. If I ever do like a in person like that's a strawberry. Like a person, like a real life whatever. Meet and greet, I guess you can say. Give me an apple pie and I'll be all's friend. Like straight up just absolute best friend. <laughs> I do not care. In your neighborhood. Hear that? I'm just saying, I really I, I like apple pie and I swear I'll do whatever. Be like a loyal best friend if I could. <laughs> I don't know why I'm saying this, but yes. Anyways, next tape. <laughs> In your neighborhood. It sounds quite threatening, but. I don't like how you're glitching Hi, like that, but okay. I'm, and I'm Wooly. Wooly. <laughs> what do you like best about your neighborhood? I just realized there's crime scenes everywhere. Wait, what? That Great. I didn't even I click like anything. That there are so many friends in my neighborhood. I didn't do Today, anything. I want to send something Wait, special what? to my friend. First, I need to go to the store to buy them a card. Do you know where the store is? That would be at the bake. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Uh, the mm, hmm. I go to the post office. <laughs> That's not the store, silly. All right, fine. Let's go. Good job. Let's go to the store. Wait, why are the letters Let's covered up? Let's pick out a card. My friend helped me when I was sad. What kind of card should I send them? So, would it be the one in the middle then? Because obviously this is birthday. That is... I don't know what that is. That is a flower. <laughs> also, why is the bablet so expensive? I don't know. That is confusing. Great! I found the perfect card. Time for the next errand. I will not be paying a thousand dollars for that. Thing, it's important to thank them. I want to get my friend a special treat. Can I have a special treat? I want to get my friend a special treat. Why well, you gotta diss Where my boy I like that? Treat for my friend. <laughs> don't be mean to Wooly. Also, why is a twenty-four-seven like? Convenience store closed. That does not make sense. Good job. Let's go get that tree. All right. What do you want to get him, Amanda? Better be quick, you up, ran me. Mm. I'm sorry. Everything smells so good. I want to buy my friend some. Oh. Friend some okay. Cookies. It starts, I guess. Can you show me where the cookies are? The cookies. I think they're the ones in the middle. I don't. My friend will like that. Are you sure about that? What about the cake? I can't mail that to my friend. Oh yes, you can. You can. You can be a good person and go to their house. Those look so tasty. Why would we you just be? Have one Wait. More stop in the neighborhood. The package is ready for my friend. They live pretty far from me, so we need to mail it. Wow, it's getting late. Most of the stores are closed. We probably can't send that now. I have to send this to my friend. It's Stop time being impatient, you little brat. <laughs> Let's send this Make me not want to have two friend. Their name is... Wait. I don't remember. Can you help me? We can come back tomorrow. You don't have to send that now. No, I have to send this to my friend. Help me. Who does the package need to go to? So, okay, you know how it said Catherine whatever it was on that thing? But well, we only got four letters, so what is the short, condensed version of Catherine? Potentially Kate. <laughs> that seems logical at this point. It feels like it gave gives us clues. Great work! Yeah, okay, there we go. Now we can send this to my friend. Uh, Wooly looks so sad. He likes the cookies. 
I, I feel bad for Wooly because he has to do with her. <laughs> he doesn't deserve this. Okay, it looked like there's something right there in that uh, split frame second thing. I don't know. How do you explain that? Like, it's... Oh, hi. Okay. I <laughs> like how it do like a slow refill. It's a little toy. Alright. So we're done with you. You can be closed. Alright. So... Okay, when I checked this out before, I was so confused. But now I understand. Honestly, <laughs> thought I had to look up the symbols, but now it's color-coded. So, if I remember correctly, or if I do this correctly, it should be... Ah, yeah, right. I had to click on it first. So, D, A, C, B, F. Voila! There you go. <laughs> now I know what I'm doing. I just realized it played a little jingle. I didn't notice that before. Yeah. That's kind of like the only downside of like trying this out to see what's different or not. So. But just, I, I would not spoil it. Oh, it's Too you. much. <laughs> Whatever you do, don't... <laughs> oh, what no. happened? Oh. Wooly had an accident. An accident is when something bad happens, but <laughs> it's no. not anybody's fault. I, I can. Accidents I think it's can somebody's fault. At, at school, at the playground, you can get hurt almost everywhere. At 3:45 this afternoon, Wait, 3 you were playing and Wooly tripped and fell. I, I didn't try. Where on Wooly does it look like he got hurt? I'm trying to take this down. Write this down. <laughs> Can't you rushing me, woman? I don't That's like that. right. Wooly hurt his knee. Who can help when you are hurting? Uh, okay. It's a six-letter word. So we got two options. A doctor or a parent. The logical option is the parent. Wait. <laughs> Logical option is the doctor. Well, you can get the parent and then go to the doctor. Let's take Wooly to the hospital to see a doctor. I don't know how you're Which getting there. Which room should we go into? Ooh, to wait, find that one's six twenty. To help Wooly. Wait, hold on. Let me get the time of that clock. Six twenty. All right. So it's not his mouth. Obviously, you probably want him to be quiet. It's not the heart. Leaves one more door left. That door. Come on, let's get Wooly fixed up. Amanda, this really hurts. When is the doctor going? The doctor isn't here right now. Let's Are you creepy little sucker? I am equally afraid to, check to have her. The heart monitor, the X-ray machine, or the scale. X-ray. That's right. Now we can look at Wooly's bones. <laughs> he looks offended, like, <laughs> bro, what? <laughs> what did you just say to me? 2001. Dang, so the, not even that long ago, huh? Alright, this company was doing this not that long ago. Oh, hi. Alright, so, okay, now we had to explain this puzzle. You just gotta... Match the clocks that were in there to this here. So what is this one? 3.45. So, do this. Bleep, bleep. <laughs> I'm not mistaken. Just get it. Oh my god. <laughs> I hate the arrows. Finikinness. Finikinness. How do you say that? There we go. Alright, then you gotta do the alarm. But it doesn't have to really matter what order of them think. Hour 10, 50. There we go. <laughs> we just been round and round, baby. <laughs> now that I look at it, that's kind of what it reminds me of. Spin me right round, baby. Right round like a record, baby. Oh, hi. Tick tock, tick tock. The app that probably ruins many people's brains. All right, before we do with that, let's fix you, or just your time, whatever. And 620. 
Obviously, you gotta do you a little bit more. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, you didn't spin. But you did turn to 515. Okay. So. Ah. Didn't get to read that, but okay. That's the precaution of taking this thing out. Guessing you go with you, since that's like the only. Yeah. There we go. So, you are the bigger one, I think. It looks like you're the bigger one. Not only because you're like a lot wider, but. Wait. So, that means you would go here. There we go. Okay, that that makes a lot more sense. Okay. I have not had a grandfather clock, so I honestly was not sure. Alright, yeah. yeah. Okay, all the clocks in here, beside, well, the ones that we set ourselves have turned to 515. It's a shame that we can't, like, mess with this little boogie bot thing. <laughs> Whatever. Hold on, set that down. Can we? Ah, uh, we can't pick you up. <laughs> My inner kid wants to play with the doll. Not that I'm not saying I play with the doll, but hey, I mean that would, that wouldn't be bad. And I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. <laughs> it's such a nice day for a picnic. Yeah. What's your favorite food to eat at a picnic? I don't mind a sandwich. <laughs> That's. Oh, I don't like that at all. What a sandwich? Uh, Amanda, what's that smell? I've never smelled anything like that. I think she passed gas. I don't know, Willie. <laughs> I think she You're just right. shat herself. It's a bad smell. What do you think is making that bad smell? I was just about to say her breath. Uh, I don't want to say that. I mean, I already did, but yeah. You. You're right. That thing looks rotten. This sandwich is stupid. Uh, why has it got to show us that? Wait, that does fly. This dump is rotting too. Do you know why? Things rot when they are not alive anymore. Do you know what the opposite of alive is? Unlived. That's what I'm. I feel like I'm about to be just unlived. Mm. I can't even spell, Uncle. Look at the tree stump. If it's not alive, what is it? <laughs> I'm being a smart ass, aren't I? That's dead. right. The tree stump <laughs> is dead. Dead is uh, the opposite kill. of alive. Good job. Why is this in a kid's show? Hey, what? Or if they get a disease. Let's go back to our nice picture. Are you in a tunnel? Are you in a pipe? Animals can die in different ways, too. Oh. Why is there a gun? Mr. Fox. He is dead and rotting. What do you think killed him? The gun, the knife, or the poisonous berries on this bush? I think it's like a trick question. I don't think that was it. No, it wasn't that. Look at his funny tuck. He's silly. What killed him? It's something Wouldn't over. Wouldn't it be nice if he could tell us? You're hiding something from me. What made you die? You you're hiding it. It was the ugly old bear trap. Exactly. Mr. Fox didn't even know what got him until it was too late. Why you got to be so sinister? This has gone too far. Uh, yeah, I agree. <laughs> we saw so many things today. Wow. A rotting sandwich, a rotting tree stump. And silly old riding Mr. Fox. I am so confused. Uh, what does that mean? Do you feel like you're dying? I can ensure that. Something is rotten here. What do you think? Do you think that everything rots? Of course not, Amanda. I'm not asking you. Why do you gotta be so mean? You don't have to answer that. All right, fine. I'll just sit here. <laughs> I can pass like 15 minutes. <laughs> All right, uh, no. See, everything is fine here. Why she looks so physically it's upset? 
She looks so sad. Wait, what? Oh, no. Wait, no. Hide. Get behind the couch. Do something. Get out of sight. Oh, no. I think I answered that wrong. I am sorry. Can you- Wait, no, stop! But we did. <laughs> we just died. We became that thing's lunch, dinner, something. I mean, it's nighttime, so it'd be closer to dinner. Oh, I just realized there's a sticker here now of that. So wait, does that mean like there's three- uh, Sorry, no, not three. Two other endings to get. Because now that sticker is there, so... Alright. Well, I guess if that is the case, let me know down below if y'all want to see me come back to this and try to find out the other endings. Even though they're probably already covered by other creators. That's fine, though. I, I don't mind, actually. Anyways, this has been the Captain Speaking. I hope you have enjoyed. If you did, I hope to catch y'all around in the next one. Until then, stay chaotic, but not too chaotic. And, uh, yeah. Bye-bye!